Um, is it true, Hazur, because in Mauritius this is a, 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 a conception which they have, um, that a widow has to stay in her husband's house for four months and ten days following his death. And what about the case of a very old lady who's lost her husband? You see, it, <coughs> it is all, it depends upon the different situations. Some old widows die and they remain in their own house because they will, the, after the death of the husband, it belongs to them. If you are talking of widows, there is no problem at all. An old lady whose children would not let her go out at all, any, any time. But if an old lady is divorced, that is a different proposition. There she has a right to remain at least four and a half months after the divorce, or divorce. But I doubt if such a lady will be divorced after reaching 75 years or 80 years old. <laughs> <laughs> that is not, it is hypothetical, it doesn't mean anything. Alors, Hazur dit que, en fait, cela va... Donc, cela va dépendre de la situation de Hazur. Par exemple, certaines... Why is she suspecting anything at all? No, actually there was a case in their family, uh, an elderly gentleman in her family died uh -huh. and uh, his wife was refusing to leave Mauritius to come to England to her children here, saying that I must stay in the that house. That is a different story altogether. It's not a question of divorce, it's a question of being a widow. Yes. And everything belongs to her and, uh, I mean, children and everything. So she's right in not uh, leaving before four and a half months. The house which is prohibited in Islam. You and your sister have prepared a song to be recited here, composed by Nasima from Mauritius, right? So you don't have any question but a song to sing. Go ahead. That's why I'm hurrying through to you. <laughs> Parmi toutes les merveilleuses choses que tu as créées, mes yeux ne brillent seulement qu'à ta pensée. Parmi toutes les parfums de nombreuses belles fleurs, il n'y a que le tien. Qui parfume tout mon cœur Elle a toutes les louanges du monde Tu ne peux vraiment définir toute ta beauté Ni de lettres, ni de mots Ni de vin, ni de poèmes ne peuvent décrire quelle merveille tu es mon maître La ilaha illallah 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 Tu es si gracieux Et si miséricordieux Que toutes les langues de mon Comment à mes yeux Malgré tout que j'ai commis comme péché, par ta grâce à la, tu m'as toujours pardonné. Elle a toutes les louanges du monde, tu ne peux réellement définir toute ta beauté. Ni de lettres, ni de mots, 
Allah, all the praises will never suffice to fully define your beauty. Nor the letters, nor the words, nor the verses, nor the poems will ever be able to describe how wonderful you are, O oh my Master. There is no God but Allah. Before all wonderful things you have created, my eyes do not shine but when I remember you. Amongst all the perfumes of the many beautiful flowers, only your fragrance perfumes my heart. You are so gracious, so merciful, that all the tears of my body well up into my eyes. Despite all my sins, by your grace, O oh Allah, you have always pardoned. You see, my composer is good songs, eh? Mm. Now, Faiza, where's my work today? Um, the children got cold. Hmm? The children got cold.